So I just finished my clinic for today. I saw a new patient today. She's uh, she's my friend. I think I'm gonna have fun with her because she has um, some restorations so I can do my dental charting eval on her. And then she has some calculus so I'm gonna have fun with her. Well, I just have to plan out when she's gonna come and then when other patients have to come so. another day of school This is my schedule for this week. I am taking three classes and plus um, my clinic being the fourth class. So for dental materials, I have to read chapter 10 and 11 and take online quiz and study for my exam two, which is on Monday and read three chapters for my radiology class and take a quiz and answer some specific questions that our professors are wanting us to answer and also do the team evaluation and individual evaluation. It's based on the radiograph that we practiced on and specify dental findings. And also for hygiene care, I have to read a few chapters and also do the team assignment. I try to prepare um, what I have to work on for each weekend in order for me to have my days um, organized. And I also wanted to show you guys my clinic preparation. So this is something that my mentor taught me. 
I will write down my patient's information, which I have to say uh, during our huddle, our group meeting before we see the patient. This is something that we will say to our instructor. And I also write down the steps that I need to take for that appointment. So we will always start with our medical or their medical history and COVID screening and then vital signs. We have to check those in order to move on to the next procedures. And this patient, I think I was working on the dental charting and period charting. And looks like I got my dental charting evaluation done. And risk assessment, all these are paperwork that we have to do in order to uh, treat the patient. So I found this very helpful and saved a lot of time in order for me to finish the patient. So clinic time is really, um, it could be long for the patients. It's like three hours long, but um, when you're in it, when you're doing it, um, this time get, can be very short and you might run out of time and you have to ask the patients to come in, you know, one or two more times because or your appointment wasn't productive. So that's why I have the sticky notes ready so I can just follow through and then I don't waste my time on anything else. Mm -hmm.